did. Like, no, what was the score? 56 to 0. Wow, you should have been more. Yeah, it was awful. Like, bad. Okay, so you know we got a test tomorrow. Time to need the answer. So I can take the picture. Oh, she comes down. Yeah, I'm gonna write down this word because I did a homework yesterday. Here you go. Get mine. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Let me see. All right, class. It's time to get into y'all study groups. Sphenoid. Close enough. Thanks, Teach. <laughs> sure. Okay, the facial bones contain the nasal, the um, lacrimal, the zygomatic, the maxilla, and the mandible. Okay, so you know the ribs contain the sternum, the true rib. What's the, what's the other one? The fake one? What's that called? Yeah, the false rib. Oh, yeah, it's yeah. That's lower down. Lower down where? Like under here. Oh, see, I'm not going to remember that. Fake and false. All right, all right. Uh, the the one with the seed, though. The cost, coastal cartilage. Oh, see, I'm not going to remember that. I'm I'm gonna have to take a picture of this because I'm. I'm not gonna remember that. There's also the thoracic vertebrae, which is you know your spine. The whole spine? No, just part of it, like. Upper part or lower part? It's like kind of in the middle, but like it's a big section. Hmm. Oh, oh, and the sternum too, that too. Yeah. That's the top part, right? The it's top like part. right here. See, I'm about to fail. I'm never going to do it because this, I can't do it. Oh, we can do it. Okay, we got this. All right, the vertebrae, you know, simple, simple. Be simple, the brackets, I can get those. Yeah. Uh, okay, I know the first part is the cervical. The second part is the one with the T. What's the name of that? That's the, the thoracic. We were talking about that a few minutes ago. Remember? Oh, yeah. It's right yeah, there. Yeah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, then the lumbar. I know that one. And the, I know the very little last one, the little tiny, tiny one. The one with the C, the, co the coccyx. Um, it's usually the, co the um, tailbone. Oh, okay. And then we miss one. It's uh, the sacrum. That's... Above the tailbone, but it's um, it's underneath the lumbar vertebrae. Okay, so above the C word, but below the L word. Yes. Oh, okay. All right, all right. I got it. I got it. Okay. Should we do the hands now? The arm? The uh, arm? Yeah, we can do the arm. All right. Are we doing the hand or the arm? Um, let's. I don't know. Let's, let's do, do the hand. All right, the hand. Right. Sort of more complex. So okay. These I know things. These are the phalanges. They're the wiggly bits. And the one with the shape, that's what? What shape? The shape. It's something with a T. That shape. Uh, the trapezoid? The trapezoid. Yeah, yeah. That's right. That's right. Oh, and also the, I know it's the metacarpals and... The carpals. Yeah, yeah. the common too. term for all of the smaller bones. All of them? Yeah, that's just the common name for things like the trapezoid, the cavitate, um, the trapezium, all those. So it's the carpal, then the metacarpal? Uh, yeah. So the metacarpals is another name for the carpals? No. I'm so confused. Do you want to move on and come back to this one? Yeah, let's move on. Okay, let's go to the arm. Okay, class, you can work with a partner now. I mean, we've been like that for a long time. 
Yeah. Okay, you know, whatever. Finish whatever you're doing. Okay, so the humerus is this big, long bone right here. And it connects to your elbow. And that's why when you hit your elbow, it's called hitting your funny bone. Because it's supposed to be humerus? Apparently. Okay, that's corny. But, you yeah. know, whatever. Uh, I know the one, the clavicle is like right here, right? Uh, it's your collarbone. The so collar it's right here. Um, Hence the collar of your shirt. Yeah. That makes sense. That makes sense. And the scapula is your shoulder blade. So like when you move your arm, you can feel back there moving. That's your shoulder blade moving. Your scapula. So the scapula is the shoulder blade? Yeah. So why don't I just call it the shoulder blade? Scientists. Confusion. Confusion. Yep. Um, let's see. The radius is the bigger bone in the arm. So, like, the lower part of your arm. It connects your thumb to your elbow. Your thumb to your elbow. And then depending on which view, depends on how it looks. Yeah. So if it's the anterior view, it's going to be right here. But if it's the posterior view, it's going to be over on this side. And it's going to look smaller. So the front of your hand and the back of your hand. Yeah. Well, this um, is the, the other one is the ulna. That's the, 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 the smaller one. It's the ulna. So the radius and the ulna. Yeah. The radius is bigger than ulna. Uh, yes. Yeah. Okay. okay. And the humerus, when you hit your funny bone, it's supposed to be funny. The humerus. And then the shoulder blade is the scapula. This, this is the humerus. Right, right here. This is the humerus. The humerus. Yeah. And what's the shoulder blade? The shoulder blade is the scapula. This is not going to work. Let's just skip it and move on to next one. Okay. So what do we want to do next? Hmm. Uh, do we want to do the um, pelvis? Not really, but I guess we can do the pelvis. Oh. Pelvis looks really weird. Words I can't pronounce. Um, teacher, how much more time left? You have a minute and a half before the bell rings. Of course. Okay. A little helpful hint, you will have to be doing a lot of labeling, so try to get the major parts that you will have trouble with. That would have been nice to know earlier. I just want to, I just try to graduate. You just don't even understand. I know, right? They make it so hard on us. Just eight more weeks of this class. Oh, well, thank just you. Think. Just think. Just eight. Right Okay class, five more minutes. Y'all can create a study sheet. You can only use one piece of paper. I'm gonna have to write down all So can we use this on the test? Yes, you can. Okay. We'll write real small, write real small. More information on the paper. Okay, we're gonna start from the beginning again, the skull. Okay. But the skull includes the um, the 
the S word? What's that one again? Uh, you know, I think I said it right. I'm not 100 percent sure. Okay, as long as you know how to spell it. Yeah. And the E word was the S um, yeah. yeah, something like that. Yeah, close enough, close enough. Alright. Wanna do facial bones now? Yeah. And the facial bones. You know, we all know the one, the nasal. Yeah. The mandible. I know the rest of this. Don't got time. I'm only got five minutes. <laughs> Just write down the ones that you need the most help with. All of them. Good luck. <laughs> Okay, class, before you guys leave, I'm going to be letting y'all leave on a bone song that y'all can look up when y'all get home. And it's a Hannah Montana bone song. And now I take it home with the varietal bone. It might be crazy, but I learned that way. Temporal and frontal too. And now I'm finding through. That makes 206. I found a way that clicks. Everybody knows the bones just had to find a way. Isn't it fun? <laughs> <laughs>